guys and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, this is my third video, so let me introduce myself. I'm Chloe, I'm a mum of three. Um, I'm new to YouTube, so please be nice. <laughs> Positive vibes on this channel only, please. Um, so today I have been on a bit of an impromptu uh, trip into Primark. It was an impromptu trip because I wasn't going at all. Basically, I've been to the gym. We've got a couple of holidays coming up. Um, so the girls group chat last night was popping off about holiday options and stuff. And I just thought, I'll go and have a little look after I've been to the gym tomorrow in town. And I mean, it's always the way, isn't it? Like a big bag later. <laughs> uh, so I haven't got loads of stuff, but I thought that I would jump on. Um, I'm gonna try and do these videos once a week, every Monday. Um, so, I've done a Primark haul, obviously this is another mini Primark haul, um, I've done a clean with me, so just trying to kind of see what everyone likes, I know those are the things that I love watching. Um, so I thought I would hop on and quickly show you um, what I bought. So let's start off, are you even going on holiday if you don't have these £1 flip flops? <laughs> My friend always laughs at me because she always has the, um, oh, what are they called? Has, Javianas, she always has the Javianas. I always have the one pound Primark ones and somehow my feet seem to slip into hers and she's like, you're not skinning my Javianas or Havanas, however you say them. But for one pound, they're literally around the pool like, why would you spend 30 quid on flip flops when you can get them for a pound? So anyway, yeah, got those. Um, I got this gorgeous beach bag. So I do have another beach bag, um, but it's a bit old and ratty now, to be totally honest. Um, why do you always, I always get like this one bit of hair that just does not stick. Uh, <coughs> it really needs doing. Sorry, I've not been very well this week, so I'm um, a little bit like snotty still and gross. So, um, yeah, I've got this beach bag, nine pounds, great size. You can stick everything in it. When you're a mum, you've always got eight million pairs of sunglasses, beach towels, bikinis, spare clothes, everything for the kids, sun cream. So I just wanted a nice, I didn't want to spend a lot on one. Um, so nine pound, nice black one. Thought that would go with everything. And um, I picked up a little bikini. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, so, I say little, it actually looks huge. Um, but I'm really in between their sizes. I'm, I'm a size 10, sometimes a 12 in something, sometimes an eight, but very rarely an eight. More, I, I'm a size 10, so I'm kind of in between their sizing. So I got these bikini bottoms, <laughs> drawstring ones. They were four pounds. So I'll report back. I didn't try those on, so I'll report back on that one. And to go with those, I got this lovely bikini top. And it's kind of, it's lightly padded. Um, I've actually taken the tag off that. So I think that was five or six pounds, but it wasn't a lot. Um, but it's just like a really nice, um, is it called an apex when it's like that? But um, yeah, really nice. Um, to go around that, I bought this sarong. It was four pounds. I've never actually had a sarong, um, but I saw Gillian Truita on her channel that she had bought one and it looked gorgeous. And I just thought, well, we're going to Greece on a family holiday in two weeks and then we get back for two days and then I'm going to Marbella with my friends. So yeah, where you wanna be a little bit dressier but feel comfortable around the pool, maybe the sarong might be nice. We'll just cover up if you're going to the bar to get a pina colada, because are you even on holiday if you don't have a pina colada? Um, so speaking of Marbella, what better excuse than to get a pink suitcase? It's given Mean Girls vibes. Um, I absolutely love it. Um, I have had, I had a, a cabin luggage suitcase up until last year that I'd had for years and years and it just got to the point where I was like standing up and it was just falling down. Um, I had a bit of a disaster last year actually. 
<laughs> I went on a girl's trip, well, a Hindu last year to Parma in Mallorca, and um, we were 12 kilos over on our luggage. <laughs> So we, I think we had to pay an extra £150 there and £150 back. So that was a, an epic fail. So basically, if it doesn't fit in this case, it's not coming. And that was actually priced at £35. Um, when I actually got to the till, it scanned through as 45 but because they'd put a 35 pound sticker on it the lady put it through at 35 so i think it was e i think it's meant to be either 45 or 40 pounds but i got it for 35 but yeah if you can't have a bright pink suitcase to go to marbella when can you um so next i love a bargain as you will come to learn five pounds love them I just wanted, I mean, the last ones that I took on holiday, they just get wrecked, don't they? Like just some comfy heels for the evening. Um, little heel, just like a mule slip on. I thought plain black, they will go with everything. So I need to actually pack. I think my next video might do a pack with me um, for, well, it will be Greece first and then Marbella. Um, I feel very lucky having a couple of holidays within a few days um so these were reduced from 11 pounds to five pounds what a bargain um so i just thought they'll go with absolutely everything i'm very basic with shoes actually and i need to get better with shoes um i did one thing i did really want um but i couldn't get was some like nice slide on sandals but like a bit dressier clumpier ones and they had some gorgeous ones in primark for 13 pound um but I'm a size six and they were really, they were really big and they didn't have the five. So I'm gonna try and go back and I'll show you those if I'm gonna get them. Um, if you watched my last haul, you will know that, oh, why am I doing that? You will know that I got these for my daughter, who's 10, uh, my middle daughter. And I love them so much that I really wanted some. So I got them for me. I thought these are just perfect for throwing on around the pool. They're like a linen. They've got a little bow um, and they're just perfect for throwing on around the pool just with like a little comfy cami top or something. Or you could dress them up and you could wear them with like heels and a blazer even. Um, but I love you those. I love those. So I will show you everything on. I'm going to try it on and then I'll show you. Um, but how gorgeous are they? So to go with them... I got this gorgeous shirt. So in my last haul, um, I got a white shirt and this time I've got an oatmeal shirt. So I, yeah, I, I don't really branch out very much. If I find something that I like, um, I just buy it in all colors. Um, but that was, that was 16 pound, which for Primark is on the pricier side. Um, I had seen one basically exactly the same in River Island with matching shorts um, that I was going to buy. And then I saw, I, can't, I think that was like £30 for the shirt and the same again, something like that for the shorts. So when I saw this, I thought that is just perfect. Um, and I thought just with um, like basic staples, chuck that on, gorgeous. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so again, to go underneath that, I thought the perfect aeroplane outfit, travel outfit, is these ribbed um, cycling shorts. Again, if you watch my last haul, I bought these for my daughter. My 10 year old's got them, my 14 year old's got them. My five year old would probably have them. Since she just turned 14, no, she's just turned 15. My 15 year old's got them. I'm not used to saying that yet, sorry guys. Um, yeah, so these are just perfect and they're a little bit, they come up a little bit longer, which I like. Um, I don't want to be wearing like teeny weeny shorts with my little three kids trotting after me like ducklings. <laughs> um, does anyone else's kids just follow them around the house? I swear my kids just follow me and if it's not a kid, it's a pet. We've got a dog and two cats and there's always someone around me. I've actually had to shut the pets out to film this video, otherwise they would be everywhere. Although maybe, maybe it'd be more interesting than me. Um, so to go, they were £4, the shorts. 
and to go with them i got this gorgeous top um so they're just perfect for the gym for underneath i thought i could wear those two with the shirt over the top um i think they're all four yeah they're all four pounds i size up in these i get a medium i don't like them um I just don't like things really, really tight. Um, and I don't like having loads of tummy on show. So I find if you size up, then you can um, like pull it up and you, you don't get that like awkward midriff bit, which is absolutely fine. But I haven't been to the gym enough to be getting this midriff out. I'll be scaring the people of Marbella. <laughs> um, yeah, so we've got that. Mm, gorgeous little set. And then the last thing that I got which isn't really a holiday thing um, I just loved it is this Aerosmith jumper I thought to go with the cycling shorts again like a perfect travel outfit maybe cycling shorts big breathy jumper the little top underneath so if you get them it's really hot you can take it off and you're fine and if um, I find planes can be really cold so um, yeah if you need to have a little jumper on um i think that was 16 pounds yeah 16 pounds i got the small um but it's quite oversized i love oversized things so um with some really nice um high tops that would be really nice or converse um oh yeah just some chunky trainers so <coughs> That's everything that I got today. It was just a mini haul. Like I say, I, I literally wasn't meant to be going in. Um, so, sauce James, hubby, when you see this. <laughs> so yeah, um, thank you for watching. I'll show you all of those things on. Um, and I think the next thing that I do will be a pack with me. So if that would be helpful, just drop a little comment down below. Um, it would mean the world if you could subscribe to me. This is only my third video, so I'm just like getting started with it all, getting to grips, but everybody's been so, so lovely so far. So thank you so much. Thank you for watching. Um, have a fab day and speak soon.